Hello, boys and girls. My name is Hotsusty, and welcome back to another episode of the Nomadic Challenge. Uh, last time, I asked you what we should do with uh, these four diamonds. Uh, options were crafting a pair of boots, uh, pickaxe, or keep them for later. Well, I ask for your opinion in the uh, in the comments. Uh, I decided to not wait uh, uh, for your comments, but go ahead and make a pick. Um, and the reason for this is what do we not need? I think we can spare the yeah, apples. The reason for the pick is that we need a diamond pick for the obsidian that we want to uh, to mine and uh, diamond armor is not really that important for the for the dragon fight so i think this is the better option and now we are off to find ourselves another village uh, to get a few more emeralds and um, yeah probably we should think about uh, getting a bit of iron armor I think that will be the level of armor that we will go into uh, uh, we will go into uh, the end with. Uh, as I see it, uh, armor in the end fight does not really do too much. It can help against uh, Enderman, but if we can avoid uh, getting damaged by Enderman, um, that should not be a problem. The bigger thing is that we could easily take fall damage and getting our hands on uh, on a feather falling four book that I can apply on the uh, on the boots. I don't think that is very likely. So I will have to find another way how to. Uh, uh, combat this this advantage so I will search a new village and then we will see what we can do there not a village but a ruined portal and this should be good for some obsidian. So, um, do not have a water bucket, so that is definitely something we can do. Um, however, 
manage the inventory a bit. Um, we can smelt a bit more iron. That should at least solve part of the problem. And then do the water bucket and get ourselves the obsidian that we need. Um, or the portal for the nether portal. And here the diamond pick comes in handy, even if mining is a bit slow. But we will get all the obsidian that we need to create a portal. All right, 20 obsidian, that should be enough. So let's grab the iron and gear ourselves up a bit. Um, boots. Um, that will not work. We'll put them on, then chest plate and helmet, right. Last thing we need. And now that looks better. So let's also grab this block of gold then there should be a chest somewhere yes there it is anything good in it nah not really you iron nuggets uh, we can craft them into ingots too. Um, sleep through the night. Um, we will get rid of the rest of them. Don't need the nether rack. Um, we'll convert those to, uh, regular ingots. And let's use the uh, uh, iron pick first. All right, I think that does it. And over there, I see some sand. Um, maybe a desert, maybe not. We will see if we find a village there. Now, just a bit of uh, shoreland so uh, let's hop into the boat and go off in that direction maybe we will find a village maybe we will find a shipwreck both are good options making a bit of uh, advancement in this game yeah I can spot a village over there so that's 
where we will be heading. A cartographer. We can use our paper with him uh, for emeralds. And we do have a Feather Falling 4 book, so eventually we will apply that on our boots. Right, that's all our paper. You have a bit more. That's it. Did free up our inventory a bit. And let's see. All the professions we can find here. Okay, baby villager. I think that's a toolsmith, weaponsmith. Um, we can definitely spare a bit of uh, coal here. Do you have anything good on your second tier? Iron. Okay, and we do the rest with coal. Yep. But that's a crappy tier. So let's see if you have, you have a bit of bread, we'll take it. Is another cartographer in there? There is a farmer. There is a hay bale. Let's see if is interested in wheat. No, he is not. Uh, maybe we can make him interested in wheat. Yes, that's battle. That's two more emeralds. Over there, it looks like the top of an uh, outpost, so we will not go near that one. So, anything else in here that could be useful for us? Chest few apples. Um, what we can do? What we can do is use a bit of our gold to make golden apples. Um, yep, I think that's good. We will keep um, bit of uh, gold on us because when we come across a cleric uh, we want to uh, to get a few uh, ender pearls off him and uh, having gold is is a good thing 
trade with. So what do we have here? Missing table, but no villager with that profession. So outpost is off in that direction. So let's head uh, through here and see what we can find in due time. Maybe another shipwreck would do us good. So let's see what's in that one. Might also be some drowns nearby, but hopefully we can avoid them. This one is in quite shallow water, so should not be uh, too difficult. Ooh, that was close. Maybe we should go in from the top anyway. Um, don't need that fence. I will break the chest and pick the things up that way. Um, then craft ingots out of the uh, nuggets. Uh, eat up. Have a look in here. Gunpowder paper. But nothing else. Unfortunately, unfortunately no uh, treasure map. Would have been nice. Um, actually, don't need the planks. Don't need the gunpowder, really. Don't need the chest either. So then, where shall we head off to this direction? This looks like a bit of flat land over here, so uh, we could find ourselves another village, if we are lucky. So, let's see. Villages, or more shipwrecks so far, but down here I found quite a big hole. So. I guess I will go exploring that one a bit uh, in the next episode. So I hope you join me for that part of the adventure. So see you then. Goodbye.